Hello ladies, I have got some news for you. Um, oh yeah, my name's Jennifer, Nail Polish Anonymous. This is not about me. This is about a scam artist. What are you doing, babe? Sorry, my boyfriend came down. Okay, so we got a scam artist. She hit on um, the glitter world back in the end of last year, the beginning of this year. She made $90 on the last swap that we never got back. And she got, um... Ladies, to donate almost $900 to her because she was crying, saying that she didn't have money for food, didn't have money to like, get to the hospital, didn't have money for medicine, but yeah, she bought $65 worth of glitter from me like three days before this. She is a scam artist. We never got our stuff back. Now she's hitting... um. The crafting world. And I am going to post right now some pictures of things she's saying to people in the crafting world. And it's so funny. It's so funny because um, last year when she was crying to everybody about having cancer and blah, 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 um, she never said anything about having a house fire and losing all her craft and stuff like that. None of it. She is a scam artist. And so bad that her, she scammed her own mother. She owes her own mother money. Her mother has tried to warn us about how bad her and her wife are if they're married or whatnot. I mean, she really plays on the heartstrings. And because there's so many new people out there right now, you know, I cover the glitter and crafting world. Um, I just want you all to be warned. I don't want you to fall for her scam. I'm telling you, scam, scam, scam. Like, I don't know. Um, oh, her name is Jeanette Wise. She goes by Jeanette and Melissa Wise on her YouTube. She used to go just by Jeanette Wise because she changed it because her mother was warning us on her other channel, Jeanette Wise. So she deleted that one and, you know, just be careful, ladies. Don't fall for her tricks. She is going to give you the biggest, saddest sob story. And that's what she does. Like, as soon as she starts talking to you, she is telling you everything that's going wrong with her. Her woe is me stories. They're all lies. Lies, lies, lies. When she couldn't give us back our swap last year, um, or February, March, I don't know when it was exactly. Um, supposedly she was in the hospital and she was dying of cancer, blah, 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 blah. Well, she, I had a friend contact Melissa and say, you know, can we get her room number in the hospital so we can send her flowers? And nobody could get that room number from her. You know why? Because she wasn't in the fucking hospital. She's a scam artist. Watch her. Watch her well. And I wish we, there was a way that she could be deleted from YouTube forever because she's just going to keep on attacking people and she's going to keep on playing her sad sobs and stories because she wants free stuff. She wants your money. She sells this stuff afterwards. Don't fall for it. Be warned. I don't have anything else to say, but be warned. Just be careful. You know, and it, other people are like this. They're, as soon as they talk to you and they start telling you their sad, sobbing stories, girl, it's because they're not, a lot of them, not all of them, a lot of people are scam artists and that's how they get you, is they tell you their sad life. Their sad life. I mean, it's pathetic. But whatever. Just be careful. And unfortunately... She's part of the reason why a lot of us are so, um, not giving anymore. Or when we are, we're very careful about who we give to. So, 
that's it. I'm done. Um, you'll notice in the emails or the little posts she's commenting on, um, that her story doesn't change. It's like she almost photocopied or pasted and, you know, copy and pasted. So <clears throat> that's it. If you have any more questions, y'all know my email. Talk to you later. Bye.